Praise the Lord, praise the Lord. Good evening and welcome. Welcome to all my brothers and sisters from all around the world. I just want to welcome you. I just want to thank you for being here to another Bible study with me. My name is Dr. PJ from the Prophetic Word. And I just want to tell you that I appreciate you being here. I appreciate you taking time out. I appreciate you studying with me. And I pray that the Lord will continuously increase you in every area of your life. Like he will give you favor in everything that you do according to his will and according to the word of God. I thank the Lord like for you, for your life, for your family. Because here you will learn about the word of God. You will learn spiritual and discernment you will learn how to fight the spiritual warfare and I pray that God will grant all of us wisdom knowledge and understanding in his precious word in Jesus Christ of Nazareth precious name amen and today I'm gonna be doing some spiritual warfare prayers at the same time I will be teaching and this topic is called the star hunters I'm gonna be praying against the star hunters of our soul the Word of God teaches us that the devil Satan is a rowing lion seeking who he may devour Satan the fallen angels which is the evil spirits the unclean spirits the demons and the workers of iniquity, those children of the fallen angels that are spread out in different levels around the world, even in this nation, they are in the school system, they are in the political system, they are in the pharmaceutical system, they are in the hospital system, they are in the government system, they are in the military system, they are in the politicians, everywhere, spiritual wickedness, banking and finance, in the educational system. The children of the fallen angels, I, they are at work 24 hours a day. They just keep seeking and seeking and plotting and planning and passing laws against us, spying, prying. And they are also, the children of the fallen angels, are in the religious system. The one world order is not a governmental system. The one world order is a political religious system is all about the religion it's all about worshiping the antichrist we pray father god in the name of jesus give us strength oh lord give us strength give us strength father god give us the spiritual strength give us strength in our body strength in our soul strength in our spirit Strengthen our life, strengthen our children, strengthen our grandchildren, strengthen our husbands and our wives. Give us strength, O oh Lord, as we embark on a daily basis, Father God, in this war against the star hunters. Who are the star hunters? Star hunters are the bloodthirsty, wicked ones in this world. The star hunters will seek you out. The star hunters are set up in several places. Every, every corporation, every workplace you enter, there's always the star hunter right there. There are those who are eaters of flesh and drinkers of blood who will hunt you down for the devil. They are hunters. Their father is the devil. They are the children of the fallen angels that came down from heaven and had children and procreated with a woman. They are called the tears. The tears are here. They are among us. They are called the generation of the fig tree. They are called the vipers. I said they are called the star hunters. The star hunters, they kill, steal, and destroy. The devil come nothing but to steal, kill, and destroy. The star hunters of your life. The star hunters of your finances, the star hunters of your happiness, your joy, the star hunters has left us 
jobless, callless, homeless. The star hunters are creating more pandemic on a daily basis. The star hunters are in the lab trying to reproduce evil things to destroy even the unborn. The star hunters are hunting children now. They're after the children, the star hunters. So we pray today in the mighty name of Yeshua Messiah, Jesus Christ of Nazareth, like God will send down fire from heaven and destroy every star hunter against our life. We pray for the against the star hunters in our community. We pray for the star hunters that surround us, the polisarios, the policia, the police. We please pray that God will destroy the very foundation of the international police that is against our life. Who is the polisario? They are the ones that was created to beat and control the slaves. Father God, in the name of Jesus, the witches and warlocks. We pray against them right now today. And I'm reading from the book of Isaiah. Amen. The book of Isaiah 49, 47, verse 13. And these star hunters, they always, when you go and visit a psychic or you go, they ask you for your full name. They ask you for your date of birth. That way they can locate your star. If they ask you for your date of birth, don't give it to them. If they ask you for your full name, don't give it to them. Because these are star hunters. And I read, it says here about the star hunters. Though our worry, verse 13, Isaiah 47, verse 13. Though our worry in the multitude of thy counsels. Let now the astrologers, the stargazers, and the monthly procrastinators stand up and save thee from these things that shall come upon thee. Every evil counsel of the astrologers and stargazers, stargazers the monthly procrastinators um, against my life um, from the horoscope, from the tarot card, from the numerology, from the uh, from the tea tree, from the palm reading. These are star hunters that will haunt your soul. What do star hunters do? They go after those people that have a calling on their life, that have good virtues, and they steal from you. They will rob you from your star. They will tap into your spiritual bank account. Father God, in the name of Jesus, every stargazer, every wicked astrologer, every monthly procrastinator against my life, against my destiny, against my children's destiny. Oh, Father God, in the name of Jesus, let fire and brimstone begin to fall upon these wicked astrologers and these wicked monthly procrastinators. Oh, Father God, let every satanic reading of my star blind them blind them oh lord let each and every one of these satanic satanic kingdoms that surround us that have my name and my date of birth to inquire against my destiny and against my goodwill and against what god has called me to do in the mighty name of jesus anyone who touching my spiritual bank account what they acquire my date of birth and my name and they're stealing my wealth and they're stealing my good fortune from my spiritual bank account and transferring their wealth to them father god let every ritualist drop down and die in the name of jesus let every satanic witch and catch fire and burn to ashes let the wicked tarot call the monthly numerology and all the trinket catch fire and let the altars burn to ashes in the name of jesus every wicked witch every wicked tarot call reader every satanic psychic high carrying thy name in the name of jesus every evil frenemy every satanic enemy of my life reading my star and hunting me down in the name of jesus blind them lord blind them blind them by fire let fire and bring some fall upon the head against these star hunters amen in the name of jesus christ of nazareth yeshua amen let god arise and his enemies be scattered
Let God arise and his enemies be scattered. Let God arise and his enemies be scattered. Let God, let God arise. Let God arise and begin to gather all these star hunters against our livelihood. The star hunters in the hierarchy. The star hunters in the secret societies. Let God arise and bring destruction. Judge them, O Lord. Judge these wicked star hunters against our life. Star hunters against your health. Star hunters against your happiness and your joy. Every star hunter of my life receive the fire of God and burn to ashes. Burn to ashes. Burn to ashes in Jesus Christ mighty name this is the hour of deliverance oh Lord that the star hunters exist the star hunters exist and I'm reading from the book of Matthew chapter 2 and I'm going to show you what the word of God say about these star hunters the, the, God is giving us examples Matthew chapter 2 verse 1 now when Jesus was born in Bethlehem of Judea in the days of Herod the king, behold, there came wise men from the east to Jerusalem, saying, Where is the he that is born king of the Jews, of the Hebrews? For we have seen his star in the east and are come to worship him. And when King Herod when Herod the king had heard these things, he was troubled, and all Jerusalem with him. And when he had gathered all the chief priests and the scribes and the people together, he demanded them where Christ should be born. And they said, In Bethlehem of Judea. And for this is written by the prophet. And what, let me explain to you what. The, the wise men did they were not evil star hunters but they was able to pinpoint the star of Yeshua Jesus Christ Almighty